you want me uh, yeah. to start with yeah. Uh, let's give credit to uh, Dino Babers and his staff and the, uh, the Syracuse players for the job that they did today. They did a nice job of making the plays that they needed to. And uh, I'm going to say that our, our team played extremely hard and uh, gave all the effort that they possibly could, and we just didn't get it done today. It seemed like some similarities to last week where you had a lot of opportunities and just couldn't capitalize on late. We just we just gotta uh, we gotta find a way to finish in those situations, you know. And, and I've got to do a better job of putting them in position to be able to make those plays. The trick play from Ratnett Williams to I think Tucker. Can you give me your thoughts on, on the way that that play turned out? Well, I mean it was uh, a play that we thought would be there in that situation, and uh, you know we just we didn't make the play. You know, it was, uh, and, I, and I, I think the play was there. We just didn't, we didn't execute it. You know, we got to execute it. We got to make a good throw. We got to make a good catch. All those kind of things. And uh, uh, it wasn't because of a lack of will. I sure. Defense kept coming up with one big series after another in the second half. Dungey goes out. Devito comes in. What, what changed? What went wrong? Uh, nothing changed. I mean, the guy, the guy had a career day. Threw the ball uh, really well. I mean, he made some great throws. Put the ball right where it had to be. You know, so you got to give him credit. Feel like y'all were prepared for the freshman to come in? I uh, I don't. I mean, the, the thing about it is, is, is they they both throw the football, and, and uh, Dungey's probably a little bit better runner, you know, than uh, than him. Uh, we didn't sit there and prepare for the quarterback, but it didn't change what they did game plan wise. Other than take out the majority of the quarterback runs. I just think you made the play for the most part after the last week. He took care of the football. He gave us a gave us an opportunity, you know, with the throws that he made. We uh, we had to throw it too many times, you know. Uh, I didn't feel like we were as effective running the football, especially in the first half, as we needed to be. But uh, we came back there in the third quarter, ran the ball much better, and uh, got back into that game. And it says a lot about our guys. How, how much of that struggle to run the ball early, with them maybe sacking the box, and they've been. Passing it, kind of it up a little bit. Well, it was, uh, you know, they had two weeks to prepare for us, and they did they did some things that were a little bit different than what we prepared for in our three days to get ready. And, uh, you know, once we adjusted, I thought we, we, we ran the ball much more effectively. Last Saturday, you said at the end of the press conference, we just kind of need a guy to step up and make plays. Daz made some plays for you today. Wasn't enough in the end, but the fact that he's growing into that kind of guy, how big is that? Yeah, he's really learning, uh, you know, first of all, he can be a, a, a true weapon. That's that's two weeks in a row that we've had them pump the ball along the ground because they were, you know, he, he was a threat to take the ball the distance. And then, you know, he's making more plays at the uh, slot position. Uh, you know, he's, he's, he's a lot to handle, and he's starting to feel more comfortable in doing all of that. Patrice Rene again, last week had a big game. He was pretty pretty solid out there today. Has he kind of hit the level where what you expected all along from him? Yeah, I think he, you know, every week he gets more and more confidence in what he does. And I think he's, uh, you know, I think he feels very comfortable in, in, in the scheme and what we're trying to do. And, uh, you know, those guys play out there on an island in a lot of, uh, a lot of situations. And I think he's, uh, he's accepted that challenge. What coach are going to get the players? What more would you like to see from your team? Uh, they can't give any more effort than what you know than what they're giving. You know, we just uh, I've, I've got to do a better job of putting them in a position to finish a game off. Thanks, Thanks, guys.